Morning, 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 morning. So this is the day, the D-Day of the Powerhouse Summit. So I'm about to get ready right now. My Uber is on the way. I'm about to jump in the Uber and be out of here. So let me go on and get to my shoe. I think Uber should be arriving shortly. Uber should be here. There's, ah, there you go, Uber. A Destiny Auto? Yeah. Thanks, man. How's your day going? How many, how many hours are you doing? Uh, uh, 16. 16 hours, that's good. That's how you're supposed Every to do day it. Of the week. Man, yeah. you, must have, you must have taken a red pill or something. Uh, I do, uh, I do, uh, I do one C4. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, cool. No, man, that works really good for me. That's what's up, man. I don't know, it's the red bull one. No, I'm saying you walk hard. That's good oh, stuff. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. That's I'll good start stuff. At 10 PM. No, that's great stuff, man. Just, just keep going, my brother. You, you know what I'm saying? Money, man. Especially here where you guys have that way way more, you know? Yeah. It's competition. Yeah. The competition is thick out here. Hell yeah. It's yeah. crazy stuff, man. Very thick out here. <laughs> so 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 with that kind of hours, how much are you clearing a week? About four I, I do about four fifty a day. Oh four fifty. That's good. That's good. That's good. So you're clearing more than ten grand a month. Oh uh, yeah. That's awesome, man. That's I awesome. Go to 11. 11. Ooh, that's good stuff, man. That's good. You're putting in the hours, man. Hour, hour. Oh, bro. Very, very good money, man. That's why in three years I haven't stopped. Oh, that's good, man. That's good. So, so what are you diversifying your money, you know, into? I have four businesses. Oh, really? Good eating. Good eating? Okay. I just started my own mini festival, music festival. Oh, that's what's Art up. Art that's what's up, man. That's, that's why I put in so many hours because um, I'm, I'm... You need to fund that. Yeah. I'm my, uh, by next year, the middle of next year. Yeah. You're done. done. That's it. And what I found out is that with this business, once you start making like over uh, over fifteen, like once you find some other income that makes you over fifteen thousand dollars a month, you don't have to do this no more. That's what it's about. You know what I mean? And that's crazy. You said that because I always crush the numbers. Yeah, that's your goal. Yeah, of course. You can't be a money man if you don't know the numbers. You got you got to know the facts, data, uh, data, and statistics to for you to function properly. Uh -huh. I always tell myself. If I make, you know, four hundred fifty, five hundred dollars a day, mm -hmm. you know, and how many days I want to do it, yeah. um, what am I going to be selling, you know, mm -hmm. what, you know, so that, that, for me, man, like, you have to have all that structured and put in place before yeah. you can even move forward. Yeah, that's right, forward. that's right. People don't understand, there's a basic foundation you got to cover. Mm -hmm. Once you cover that basic foundation, Execute. It, 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 it actually opens up a path for greater mm -hmm. things. It does. So. It does. Once you open, once you open up, um, that time mm -hmm. where now I can spend 16 hours on my business. Yes. You're See, limitless. Once I can do that. You're limitless. Oh Let me ask you this question, right? Since you started making money, right? What dollar amount would you say as soon as you crossed it, life started looking easier, you know? So, uh, uh, like as far as like it didn't seem so hard anymore? Yeah. Um, I feel like, you know, we have our own cleaner business too on the side. Oh, so okay, okay, okay. I've seen, I've seen Ten to thirteen thousand dollars a month. No, 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 I'm saying how mu how much have you had in your bank account? And once you saw that money in there, the way you moved in life, it seems like you could see the light at the end of the tunnel. You know, oh, like yeah. yeah. So for me, for yeah. me is um, I always have a percentage of what I want to keep in and what I want to take out. Oh, okay, okay, and okay. I always have a percentage of, of you know of. Uh, so at what number, at what exact number did, um, did life start seeming like? I feel like me, um, for me honestly, as long as I can keep, mm -hmm. as long as at all times I have about at least 20 grand in here. Oh, that's good. good. That's a good number. Yeah. Good. That's that's I, a very good number. As long as I can keep making money and mm -hmm. now I got 20 grand in there, yeah. I can get money. That's, that's a good number. That's a good number. Yeah, I, I, I noticed that uh, me personally, as soon as I crossed uh, the ten thousand dollar mark, yeah. you know, life started seeming a little bit, you know, more easier. Like life was playing in my favor oh, at yeah. that point. That's how you need to make mm -hmm. it in life, man. That's the only way to do it. And you have to make sure you have enough money. Uh huh. To where if something wants to ever hit the fan, yeah, you'll be good. You'll be good. That's how I look at it too. That's how you 
work, but you need to learn how to have money management. You need to know good money, not just money management. I, f I find out that money management kind of equates to time management too. Do you find out the same thing? You cannot be a good money manager if you're not a good time manager. Right, 100%. Yeah. 100%. How many people work for them? I see what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. there's always going to be the owners and the workers. So you just choose your side. Choose your side. Like no, no, no harm, no foul against no. you though. Whichever side you choose, no, you I just get. Think. Yeah, exactly. You yeah. just got to deal with the outcome. Right. Exactly. You can't complain. You can't complain. <laughs> no, because, because for me, don't don't com don't complain. Yeah, when you're not trying to do nothing about it. Especially when the doers are doing. Don't, don't get mad, because they're just doing what the what the, what side they chose. They're playing for the team they chose. And and and, and don't get upset when you see right? me doing. Don't get you know. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I, yeah. We're still friends. I'm just, I told him, we're on different levels, man. You know, one of the things I don't like is when men think that all men are on the same level. Nah. You know what I mean? Nah, nah, nah. You know, so it's, it's a very shitty thing. Nah, I can't do it, man. <laughs> you know, as, a, as a black man in general, yeah. we already are looked at down here. They're looked at down. So that's Even why. sometimes when we're actually not down there, you still be looked up like you're down there. Because the reason yeah. why is because we're not supposed to be here. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's not that we're not supposed to. We're subjugated what? to where we are. Okay. Okay, so we're mm -hmm. supposed to be here, mm -hmm. but history, They'll, history placed us where it placed us. I see what you're saying. Right. Yeah. You know, so you're right. We're, mm -hmm. we're supposed to be here, but the way they but, see it is they didn't want us to be here. I see what you're saying. So now it's on you. It's on you. To put yourself wherever yeah, you want to put. Yeah. The stratification is there. Just place yourself wherever you choose. Wherever you choose. I got you. If you want to work somewhere for 30 years? It's on you. It's on you. It's on you. If you want to go start a business and make a billion dollars, it's on you. <laughs> it's an amazing thing, yeah. man. Yeah, I love this conversation, I mean, bro. Right, because it, it, it's, it's real life. Bro. It's real life. This is this these what's guys, going these on. Guys, these guys own these buildings and all this stuff. Yeah. They get to travel wherever they want. They fly wherever they want. Whatever the hell they want. Yeah, man. You know, it's like why why are you living why are you living life? And and once again, not, not on your terms. Why are you not living life on your own terms? On your own. <laughs> it's a crazy thing, man. You know, it's a crazy thing. It's wild, bro. I would never get it. Somebody worked for one company for 13 years, right? Jesus. And they're only making 28 an hour. Are you serious? Right. Oh, Walmart, wow. Walmart employee. Oh, man. That's crazy. I'm, so I'm right here in front of the Ferrari. Yeah. Okay. Right here. Okay. Thank you. I, I'll pull, I'll up, pull right up right here. Thank you so much for the conversation, man. What's this right here? This is uh, a tour convention, right? It's a uh, power host summit. Okay. So guys that own over 10 cars or have made over $36,000 a year. Yes. Okay, so, man. you know, the company organized a convention where we all get together and me, I'm here to network, but we'll see what else they have in stock. Good. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so man. you take care, man. Stay hard. Okay. All right, bro. I'll leave you a good tip. Uh. Ooh, there we go. So here are the cars. This car is a Rivian. It was brought here by Rivian. Here's another Rivian. They even got a Ferrari 488. I believe this belongs to one of two renters. And over there, it says the owner. This Chen 2008. This is a Nissan. Chevy C8 Corvette. This is a GMC. And I believe these are all cars belonging to Turo Host. It's amazing. So it's brought to you by Nissan. The Spider.
I like this. It's a lot of this in Chicago. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's more in Florida. <laughs> yeah. And just like that, every good thing comes to an end. We're done at the Turo convention, day one, and I'm out of here. So I just wanted to give you guys an update. I'll see you in day two. Ciao.